What's happening, people? Welcome back to another episode of Money Moves Marketing and Manhood. This is your man, Benji Rich's Marketing, and my ultimate goal is to help people like you start, grow, and scale your business through digital marketing. But on today's video, I'm going to talk about my story, talk about my life, talking about helping millennial men get to the next level. Before we get started, make sure you like and subscribe to this YouTube channel. Uh, if you are a father, which I just found out from my stats, 80% of the people that watch my channel are men. So if you are a father looking to level up your life, increase your impact, your income, or your influence, this video is going to be for you. If you are going through challenges and you need some motivation, this video is for you. If you are a father and you need help creating more streams of income, this video is for you. If you are working hard and it's just not good enough and you're not being supported at home around your family or friends, this video is for you. Because ultimately, I want to start off by saying black man, uh, black man, not just black man, um, black man, all men, I love you. I support you. And I want to know that you are worthy and you are loved and you are supported. And I'm and that's coming from another black man, because the biggest thing that I feel like black men lack in the world uh, is support. Um, I've been married once. I've been in a serious relationship right after that marriage. And during my process of learning and leveling up as a man, the biggest thing that I can say that I needed, that I longed for was support. To have somebody there to actually walk with me, believe with me, have faith with me, actually to get to the next level. Uh, and one of the biggest lessons that I learned becoming a man and becoming a father, becoming a better father, becoming a father figure is at the end of the day, if it's meant to be, it's up to me. You know, uh, we grow up in life, in life with our family and our friends and you are molded by your environment. And not everybody is always equipped with everything that they need to succeed in life. Some people have more than enough. Some people have way less than enough. But ultimately, when you turn 18, you as a man are responsible for yourself. It doesn't matter what happened to you. It doesn't matter what you're going through. In the end, you are responsible for yourself to be a man and provide for yourself. And if you decide to get a woman, you know, the common standard is for you to provide for your woman and for your kid. But the ultimate thing is no one is showing men how to be better men. No one is showing men how to walk through this uh, through this journey that we call life. Uh, no one is showing men how to deal with their emotional issues on the inside. Um, we're just told to ball it up and deal with it. And I am telling you, you need to get around more like-minded men that are going to the next level. The ultimate point of my business is actually to help men and single parents become financially free to be able to spend more time with their kids by creating content that turns into cash. So ultimately, I want to show you how you can turn your everyday life and your everyday assets that you use and actually turn them into mon monetary gain and actually document the process in the process so you can help somebody else get through their process. Um, my name is Benjamin Tankard and I have been married and I have been divorced. And I must say, fellas, yes, um, my marriage did not dissolve because I cheated on my wife. But did I cheat on my wife? Yes. Um, could I have done more in my marriage? Yes. But the biggest thing that I learned about the situation is I just wasn't in tune with myself. I just wasn't mature in certain areas. I wasn't able to communicate. I wasn't able to be the best provi best provider, best leader, best anything that I needed to be because it really wasn't drawn out on a blueprint for me. I wasn't in organizations. My father, my father was in my life, but he really didn't show me the foundations and the honest things that I should do to maintain a relationship, to keep a relationship, to not let it spill over and self-destruct. Like my dad went through two divorces and I never really sat down and talked to him and understood why he went through those divorces. How did he get to this certain position and point in his life, which has shown me that I have literally repeated my dead cycle because I have not decided I have not decided to step back and learn from his mistakes so I don't turn around and have my mistakes because as of right now in my mind I'm living a generational curse because 
I'm doing what my dad did. You know, I'm having multiple kids, mom, being in multiple serious relationships. But ultimately, what I take from this is my next relationship will be my best relationship. And the reason why, because I'm learning how to be more in tune with myself. I'm learning how to be a better communicator. I'm learning how to be a better father. I'm learning how to be a better leader. I'm learning to always educate myself and have myself around people that are doing better than me. You never are going to know it all. You're never going to know it all. You may think you know it all, but you don't know it all. There are things that we are consistently learning. My dad is 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 fifty something, but he is still learning how to be a better father and support his kids. He has to handle each kid differently because each kid has a different need in their life. And ultimately, I would advise every male watching this video, get yourself together before you decide to be with somebody else. I totally understand why they say you should not get married until you are um, 30 or older or you or you shouldn't get married until you're financially stable. The reason why you should not get married to you are financially stable or you're in your career is because 65 percent, if not 75 percent of the issues that you have in your marriage are going to be because of finances. Or if you have finances, they could solve those problems. You know what I mean? And what I mean solve those problems by if you do have issues, you could pay for a counselor. If, if Most women are divorcing men for lack of money. So that means if you had money, you could afford to pay the bills to where she isn't leaving you because you don't have money. You see what I'm saying? And then also, it is our selection in women, fellas. We have to stop going after the eye candy. We have to stop going after what we think is is what's best for us no that's just the eye candy you need somebody that truly supports you somebody that truly holds you down somebody that truly is willing to build with you and grow your impact your income and your influence to the next level so i just want to motivate and i want to inspire every man who's watching this video who made it to the end to do something different in 2023 put yourself in a different environment put yourself around different people Push yourself to get into the next level because faith without work is dead. And I've I've been soul searching for a long time, but honestly, I decided to step back and I started to get to know myself because the more that I know myself, the better that I can operate in any relationship, any environment, uh, and I can deal with any situation. So my question to you is in the comments below, let me know what are your three biggest takeaways from this video and what are three things that you can do better in your life to be a better man in 2023? How can you provide better? How can you be a better father? How can you be a better brother? How can you really help yourself become financially free? And make sure you subscribe to my YouTube channel because my ultimate goal is to help people like you, single parents and fathers, start growing scale of business and increase their impact, their income and their influence by just turning their content into cash, creating videos like this about expertise that they're in to drive traffic to their business, to get more sales. You know, uh, I'm going to document my whole process. Today is July, no, today is December, December 16th. Um, yeah, today is December 16th and the year is almost over. And I just want to encourage everybody to put in the work, have the faith and execute. Execute, execute, execute. Work every day and figure out how you can better yourself, how you, how you can be around more like-minded people to actually push you and propel you to get to the next level so that you may be great and God can bless you and your family. If you're a male and you want to connect, if you want to be friends, DM me. I'm looking to connect with more like-minded males that are looking to go to the next level. And I'm looking to create an organization, a group of men where we have love, where we have support, where we have finances actually in getting to the next level. Because it seems like nobody's helping men. So you know what? I'm going to be the man to step out there and help the other men. My name is Benjamin Tanker Jr., also known as Benji Riches Marketing. And my ultimate goal is to help fathers and single parents become better influencers, income providers, and leaders of their family. So if that sounds like something that you would like to do, something that you would like to start, something like you would like to get into, make sure you DM me, make sure you follow me on YouTube, make sure you follow me on Facebook. Uh, I'm looking to I'm looking to grow. I'm looking to network with a lot of people. I'm looking to go to the next level in 2023. And if that sounds like you. If you sound like if you seem like you're a good fit for me, and we can have a good uh, work relationship, and you're ready to make some money, get tapped in and get wrapped in. Follow me at Benji Riches Marketing. I look forward to seeing you, hearing you, hearing you, and growing with you. Have a great day. Let's get it.